Shabbat Shalom. I'd like to welcome you all to our Beth El Tzedek Shabbat evening celebration. Uh, we are Rabbi Sandy and Dennis Sasso. Welcome you to our home and feel invited to enter yours and share with you this evening uh, filled with uh, celebrations and new beginnings. Uh, I'd like to call your attention to the website of our congregation, Beth El 613org where you can access Shabbat virtual resources, uh, including links to the prayer book that we will be using, as well as song sheets. You will also find there uh, lists of our religious school faculty and seniors whom we will be honoring this evening. Uh, I'd like to uh, welcome uh, to the virtual Bima, Rabbi Jenny Greenspan, Cantor Melissa Cohen, and we thank uh, uh, Sherry Levine and Jackie Goldstein for keeping us all connected on the Shabbat. Uh, today was Lagba Omer, a day traditionally dedicated in the Jewish tradition to honoring learning uh, uh, of Torah, scholarship. So tonight we honor our teachers. We call this evening Shabbat HaKavod, the Shabbat of honor. Um, it is a sad day in Israel uh, due to the loss of many lives in an observance of uh, th this holiday, uh, but uh, we link memory to uh, celebration tonight uh, as we honor Torah and uh, both the teachers and the students who make up our congregation and represent its future. I'd like to invite you to welcome Shabbat with Cantor Melissa by singing Shalom Aleichem, we usher in the Shabbat angels of joy and of peace. Page 13. Shalom Aleichem, Malachi Hashadim, Malachi Our Shabbat dinner table blessings will be recited tonight by 
uh, representatives of our religious school and education program and to recite the candle blessing on page five. It's my pleasure to invite Dina David Smith, who is the director of our Hebrew department at Bethel Zedek. Okay, I'll be right back. I, I want to just light my candles so I can light the candles. Just one second. I'll be right back. Okay. Let there be light. See if it were that simple, huh? Okay, I hope you can also there you go. Candles. ברוך אתה אדוני, אלוהינו מלך העולם, אשר קידשנו במצוותיו וציוונו להדליק נר של שבת. אמן. תודה רבה, דינה. אתה נראה מאוד שבתניק. שבת שלום. שבת שלום. ועכשיו שאנחנו עושים שבת עם שבת, אנחנו נזכרים את ג'ורג' קלי, שהוא עם דיאן, גם עם תלמיד שלנו בלימודי הלימודים. ג'ורג' הוא הדירקטור של הלימודי הלימודים, כמו שכל אחד יודע. will lead us in the Kiddush, page 119. In. <laughs> Zikaron l'mase v'reshit, ki hu yom tehila l'mikra'e kodesh, zecher l'itziad mitzrayim, ki aleinu karata, ve'otanu ki dashta le'avodatecha, v'shabat kodshecha, ve'ahaba uvratzon, Hinkatanu, Baruch Atadonai, Mekadesh HaShabbat. Amen. L'chaim. L'chaim. Here. That was, that was lovely. It looked like you were serenading one another uh, there, George and Diane. Well, that's what Shabbat is all about, right? Candles, wine, songs. Lovely mood. And now we invite our teacher, Rebecca Maccabee, who represents the teachers this evening and about whom we'll say a word later. So Rebecca, if you have a challah with you and would lead us in Hamotzi. Am I unmuted? Yes. Okay, okay. I think I was the only one who was willing to bake, so that's why I got this. Beautiful. <laughs> All right. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Hey, Avon, everybody, take a bite. Thank you, Rebecca. We'll have you back in a little bit. Oh, sorry. It's right there. <laughs> And as we have uh, recited the blessings uh, for the table ushering of Shabbat, we offer uh, a prayer for peace for all our families, for our community, and for the people of Israel and the world. Uh, for our uh, children, we say, Yesimcha Elohim Kefraim Vechimenashe, Yesimech Elohim Kesara Rivka Rachel Veleya. May God bless you as God blessed the founders, the ancestors of the Jewish people. May God bless you and keep you. May God be gracious to you and show you kindness. May God look with favor upon us and grant us a Shabbat of joys, a life of health and a world at peace. I want to say Amen. Amen. Shabbat Shalom, everybody. Shabbat Shalom. We continue with our welcoming of Shabbat as we turn to L'cha Dodi. You may follow on page 41 
and 47 of the prayer book. Welcome the Shabbat Bride and Queen. Welcome Shabbat to our praying community, to our homes, and now we express the joy of coming together for Shabbat celebration. Hinematov, how good, how wonderful, pleasant it is to come together in unity. Page 535, Hinematov. <laughs> And now that we have gathered as a community, the best thing is to celebrate new life, more vitality, more joy to our community. So we turn this moment to the Doc family. And we are delighted to celebrate with Noah and Emily Doc, with grandparents Barb Bixler and Maury Doc, with Cindy and Rick Malachy, uh, and with big sister Evelyn, the arrival of their little sister who came some time ago. She came just about a year ago. She will be a year this coming week on May 4th. But present conditions uh, have required that we wait a little bit. And here we are to celebrate her naming. So it is with great joy that we welcome Izzy. We'll give her name in a few moments. She is a fifth generation member of Beth El Tzedek. And I have had the pleasure of knowing all five generations of the family and to celebrate Simchas with them. Uh, and uh, on this moment, as we celebrate Izzy's arrival, I'd like to invite mom and dad to offer a prayer of thanksgiving. We have been blessed. We have been blessed with the gift of new life and have privileged to participate in the marvel and beauty of creation. But by, by, by the way, by the way in which we live, we aspire to teach our daughter to become a caring and loving person who will also accept her responsibilities to others and to her heritage. Blessed is the holy source of life who causes parents to rejoice with their children. Evelyn, I'd like to, I'd like to see you, Evelyn. You are the big girl. You, can I see you? Because I can't see you where you are there. Let me see your pretty face. How old are you? Are you two? How old are you, Evelyn? You're going to be two. Four? Oh my gosh, you're going to be five. 
quicker than, than I realized. So we are happy that you are happy with your little sister. So we say, God and creator, bless these happy parents and their big daughter with the wisdom to teach their child and little sister to be faithful to the heritage of the household of Israel. Grant her health of mind, strength of body, that she may enjoy fullness of years and live to do your will in faithfulness. Amen. What is, Evelyn, what is the name of your little sister? Can you tell me her name? Easy. Okay, we're gonna have mom and dad tell us about her name now. We give. We give to our daughter the name Isadora Louise Da. In Hebrew, Simcha Yidida Ba'at Yisrael Ba'emelin. We have chosen to name our daughter after her great-grandfather, Isidore Da. May God's blessing rest upon our daughter now and always. Thank you. Beautiful name. And I remember well the great-grandfather after whom she is being named. So we confirm that name. Miriam Anevia Ruth Be Abigail Be Estera Malka, Yevarecheta Yalda Aneima Azot, Be Karechma Be Israel, Simcha Yedida, Bat Israel Be Emily, Kotul Adonai Kitov Kile Olam Hasdo, Zot Haketana, Simcha Yedida, Gedola Tihie. Beautiful name means joyous friend, joyous beloved, Yedida. God who bless Sarah and Rebecca, Rachel and Leah, Miriam the prophetess, Abigail and Esther the queen, bless this beloved child and let her name be known in Israel as Simcha Yedida, but Israel the Emily. May her name be known for good and for blessing. May mom and dad be privileged to see her grow in health, peace and contentment. Give thanks to God for all that is good, for love that endures forever. May this little child, Isadora Louise Doc, Izzy, Simcha Yedida, grow into womanhood as a blessing to her family, the Jewish people, and all humanity. And repeat from your places after me. Keshem. Keshem. Shenich Nesa. Shenich Nesa. Labrit. Labrit. Ken Tikanes. Ken Tikanes. Le Torah. Le Torah. Le Chupa. Le Chupa. Ule Maasim Tovim. Ule Maasim Tovim. As this child is brought into the covenant of our people, so may she grow into a life of Torah, marriage, family joys, and good deeds. And let us say, Amen. Amen. Mom and Dad, you have a Kiddush cup with you? Let's raise it and say together the blessing over the cup of joy. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Bore Peri Agafen. Amen. Amen. Noah and Emily, could you unmute yourselves? Kent, uh, Jackie or Shari, could you un unmute them? Got it. Go. Um, see? Got I it. Know. Okay. Technology. Magic. Beautiful. Yeah. Baruch Atah Adonai, Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, Shekakiyanu, Vekiyamanu, Vehigiyanu, Lazman Hazet. Amen. And uh, we have a few gifts that have already been sent to Izzy. Did you get those in the mail yet? Yes. Okay, there you are. So a t-shirt uh, that says that uh, she was named that Bethel Sedek, virtual Bethel Sedek, right? Yeah. And she also gets a bib yeah, that. that says future Bethel Sedek babe. <laughs> and that's a pre-registration certificate for our early childhood and any other program. All she has to do is present this when she comes to the synagogue and she gets admission to anything she wants. <laughs> and a kippah, let's put the kippah on her. Beautiful. She is ready. And we ask mom and dad. Yeah, and of course, Evelyn, who has uh, those same items, can uh, help uh, put them on. So we give a blessing to our child. Put your hands over both your children, take Evelyn with you if you can. And we say, May God bless you and keep you. May God be gracious to you and show you kindness. May God look with favor upon you, your family, and give you a life of health, of joys, and of peace. Amen. Mazel tov. 
you you can kiss the mother, Noah, <laughs> and you can kiss the daughters now. And we are delighted to celebrate. And we do a Siman Tov, a Mazel Tov from the cantor. Siman Tov, a Mazel Tov, a Mazel Tov. Mazel tov, everybody. Congratulations to the grandparents, uh, uh, Barb and Maury and Cindy and Rick, and to all family and friends who joined this evening's celebration. See you in the synagogue, uh, hopefully not too long from now. Thank you. Mazel tov. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. Keep, keep making beautiful babies. <laughs> <laughs> Not going for the boy soon? We're good. We're we good. Have boy dog. Yeah, we have boy dogs. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Rabbi Jenny, take it over. Just as we have welcomed Miss Izzy into our people, we now turn to the declaration of the oneness of our God who binds us all together as one people, now with Izzy included. We turn to the Shema on page 65 that will conclude on page 73. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. The <laughs> Uvelechteka <laughs> Adonai Eloheichem, Asher Hotzeti Atchem, Me'arat Mitzrayim Liyot Lachem Lelohim, Ani Adonai Eloheichem, Adonai Eloheichem, Amet. Page 85, we find Vishamru, a selection of verses from our Torah to celebrate our Shabbat. Page 85. Vishamru Bnei Yisrael, Shabbat, these moments of rest and calm. We also think of those in our community who could use a moment of rest and healing. And so we say, God of our ancestors, as you have cared for the children of Israel, we ask you to care for our beloved community members who are in need of healing. This week, we think of Jim Fleischer, Shirley Steinman, Ron Safran, Aaron Linderman, 
Rick Malachy, Lisa Sachs, Bonnie Kaplan, Elaine Safran, Larry Baker, Sue Baker, Roger Lord, Dr. Doug Packer, Eleanor Gelman, Levi Chisholm, Shoshana Batmasha, Brian Doner, Angela Fry, Mickey Kaur, Amy Mauer Martin, Don Fisher, Rena Clark, Jean Newener, Doreen Gray, Mike Isabel, Andrew Reed, Aaron Greenwald, Lorraine Greenberg, Daniela Sasson, Brooke Friedel, Julia Whitehead, and those you are entering into the chat as well as the Cantor Sings Our Misha Beirach prayer found on our song sheet on our website. <laughs> the source of strength, oh bless the ones before us, help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing, and let us say, Amen. God, for all those we mentioned aloud that were written to the chats and those whose names we hold close, please be with them in their times of sickness and suffering. Treat them with compassion and guard them safely through danger and lend them a portion of your strength. So we'll at this time, we'll take a moment of quiet prayer, a moment of Shabbat Amidah to reflect on the joys and the lessons we've had in the week past and the moments we hold on to. Take a moment of silent prayer. Who creates peace in the heavens grant peace to us to all god's people israel and all who dwell on this earth we say amen amen well we are transitioning uh, as we enter shabbat from lagba omer as we mentioned earlier a day that honors uh, teachers and disciples and the learning and the teaching of torah so tonight we take some moments to thank all of our Judaica teachers, our Hebrew teachers, our clergy, our youth advisors, and the educational office staff for their dedication to our students from kindergarten through high school in the Rabbi Sidney and Shirley Steinman Religious School. Uh, the list of names of our educational staff is posted uh, on our website uh, for you to look at, uh, as we cannot provide you with a uh, with a pamphlet this evening as we customarily do. Uh, we have teachers in our religious school who have been uh, involved with uh, Bethel Settics Sunday School for decades, including Alvin Katzman, 
Cindy Harp, Diane Kelly, Rabbi Bruce Pfeffer. And of course, we have a teacher, an educator, whom we all love, who has been with us for 40 years. But we will be recognizing Joni next week. And we expect that you will all be joining us for that uh, very special uh, tribute uh, to Joni. Um, every year, we honor people who have completed multiples of five years of service. And tonight, we thank Rebecca Maccabee, who led us in the Hamotzi uh, this evening. She has worked for the religious school for five years. First as a third grade uh, Judaics teacher, and now on the fourth grade Hebrew level. Uh, she's also a regular Hebrew lab teacher. Rebecca is dedicated to the students and goes out of her way to make classes fun uh, environments. Uh, Rebecca is a particularly thoughtful and caring person. Uh, she is known for bringing Mishloach Manot, gifts of friendship during Purim to fellow teachers and synagogue staff. And I noticed in her typical caring way that she posted during the healing prayer, a remembrance of all who hurt in, in Israel and the uh, rising uh, index of COVID in India. Rebecca is always thinking of Gemilut Chasadim, doing deeds of kindness for others. She's also a regular participant in our daily minyan. So Rebecca, tonight we thank you for your dedication to our children, for your commitment to their Jewish education. Um, on this Lagba Omer entering Shabbat, you are a model and an example of what teaching of Torah represents. So let's all hear it for Rebecca. Can we shine a face on her as well? Thank you. You also have uh, posted in the website the names of the young, there's Rebecca. Say hi, Rebecca. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. There are the names of our students who are graduating high school, whom we also recognize this evening. And uh, we extend the mazel tov to them, to their parents, um, with gratitude for all that has been done so far and with hopes and uh, aspirations for the future. Uh, many of the graduates are with us tonight and we would like to recognize them now as they are spotlighted. So as each, per I'm gonna call the names and hopefully uh, Jackie and Sherry will be able to find and spotlight. We'd like to ask each student to state his or her name, where they are graduating from and what are their plans for next year. So why don't we go ahead and do that. And of the students that are in the full list, let's begin with those who said they would be with us is Isabella Birani. Bella Birani. Can we find Bella? I saw her. There she is. Hi, Bella. You have to unmute. unmute yourself. <laughs> she can't. She can't. I've never heard you silenced. There okay, you are. Sorry, it was letting me. Okay, I'm Bella Barani. I'm graduating from Carmel High School, and I am planning to major in sociology at the University of Illinois next year. Mazel tov, Bella. Thank you. Bella has been very active, as all of our students have. Can I get an ILL? I'm an alum. There you go. Yes. And Ben Fang is with us tonight. I saw him there with uh, his dad a few moments ago. Hey, Ben, unmute. Yeah. There you go. Uh, yeah, so I am Ben Fang. I'm graduating from Carmel High School, and next year I'll be pursuing engineering at Purdue University. Congratulations. Mazel tov. And you and your dad are going to open a, a joint... Uh, medicine and engineering uh, uh, enterprise, right? And we have Spencer Fleischer with us tonight. There he is with mom. Unmute, there you go. Yeah. No. 
Hi, my name is Spencer Fleischer. I'm graduating from Carmel High School and I'm studying media advertising at IU next year. Mazel tov. Nice to see you. And we also have with us tonight, Haley Fox, who joins us from a unique place. Where is Haley? How come you're not with Haley, Spencer? <laughs> she needed some support. Where is she? Okay, I don't see Haley Fox listed. So if her name is not listed as Haley Fox, I cannot find her. Maybe she could raise her hand if she's Haley. here. Of course, Haley's with us. She's with Dan. She, no, she's not with Dan. Oh, she she is, is, uh, you know why she's not listed? Because she is from her phone because she is at the Carmel Natatorium. Let's find Haley. Dad, how can we do that? Hmm. I know that Haley made a special effort. She is in the final swim meets. Uh, okay, I've asked them to unmute. So we'll okay. see what happens. If not, we'll come back to her. Maybe come back. Okay, should we move on and then come back? I think that's a good idea. Okay, we have Joshua. Friedman with us. Uh, I don't know if Talia is also with him, but I got the name that Josh was with us. There you are. Hello, my name is Josh Friedman. Um, I will be graduating from Carmel High School this year, and next year I plan to be pursuing uh, physics at Purdue. Oh, a couple of Purdue's. Make sure you guys connect with one another. Okay, uh, and now we have Nathan Geyer. Here's Nathan. Unmute, Nathan, there we go. Hi, um, I'm Nathan. I will be graduating from Carmel High School and I plan to major in finance at IU next year. Mazel tov. Going into business uh, with your mom in legal and finance. You know? And then we have Eli and Jacob Kurlander. I guess we can show them together unless they're in separate rooms. Mazel tov. That must be them. Are we showing the Kurlanders? Takes a second. <laughs> okay. We are so grateful to Jackie and uh, to Sherry for keeping us connected. And I've asked Eli to unmute. But... Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> sorry. Can, oh, shit. I can't. <laughs> okay. Um, sorry. Why is it like this? Okay. Sorry. Um, so both me and Jacob are graduating from Carmel High School. Um, and we're both attending IU. Um, I'm studying public policy. And I'm gonna be studying biology next year and hopefully become a doctor like my dad. Oh, I thought you were twins, but I see there's a triplet in the picture there. <laughs> Mazel tov. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. And next on my list of people present is Maddie Mundy. Unmute, Matt. Can't hear you. Okay, uh, okay. now yes. Uh, I'm Madison Mundy and I'm graduating from Los Pachua High School. I will be studying um, history at the University of Groningen and then I'll work next year. Yeah, the same matter. Could you repeat uh, the last sentence? It kind of get uh, closer to your mic. Uh, I will be attending Groningen University in the Netherlands and studying history. Wow, going to Holland. Wow. I have Dutch ancestry. <laughs> we'll have to talk. Okay, Mazel tov. And Ryan Plaskoff. Yeah. 
So yeah, my name's Ryan. I'm graduating from Burbuff Jesuit and I'm attending Ohio State next year for a double major in aviation and business. Oh, that's uh, very high, high aspirations. <laughs> Congratulations. And Lily Rosenberg is with us tonight too. Mazel tov. There is Lily. Hi, I'm Lily Rosenberg. I'm graduating from Burbuff Jesuit and I'm going to IU next year and I'm majoring in international business and law ethics and decision making. Good job. Oh, gonna fix the world, huh? Yeah. Okay. Great, <laughs> Great to see you guys. Mazel tov. Well, that is the list of those who told us that they would be on. Can we get back to Haley by any chance? Okay, let's see. Haley, wherever you are, we wish you a mazel tov as well. And I uh, know that Haley is going to IU. And dad, you wanna, or mom, if we cannot connect with her, you wanna tell us something? There you are, mom and dad, speak for Haley, only this one time. Right, yeah, so Haley doesn't uh, want us to speak to her too much, but yeah, so uh, sorry that she can't be with us. Uh, she might be just logging in right now, but uh, Haley will be going to IU. She's going to be studying in the O'Neill School of Public and Environmental Affairs um, with a focus in sustainability. Great, and she's graduating Carmel, right? Correct. Okay, well, mazel tov to Haley. And Thank shabbat you. shalom to everybody. From your places. What about Dalton Waldman? Is he with us? Yeah, where's Dalton? Okay. There you are, Dalton. I'm Dalton Waldman. I'm graduating from North Central High School. I'm going to Wabash to double me. Wait, wait, wait. We lost you at the end. We lost your voice at the end. After you told us that you were going to Wabash, we didn't hear the rest. Hmm. Good change, change. Okay. If not, just just uh, you can write it in the chat um, mm -hmm. where you're you're going to Wabash and you're going to be majoring in. You lost your audio. Lost your audio. Okay, we'll get we'll get the word out, Dalton. And um, I just recently spoke. Yeah, yeah it's working now. <laughs> Say it again. So I plan to double major in business and engineering, and then minor in ROTC. Oh, I know that you've been involved in that for quite a while. Well, congratulations to all of you guys. We want and Rabbi, you to I believe yeah. Haley has joined us. Okay, let's take a look at Haley. <laughs> Put your finger to your ear. There she is. <laughs> She's all wet. Speak to us, Haley. Your, your parents tried to say a few things. But I think you can communicate uh, for yourself. Tell us who you are, where you're graduating, and where you're going to school. Haley, did you get the prompt to unmute? Just hit unmute if you can. <laughs> Haley, can you hear us? Shake yes for. Uh, yeah, sorry, I couldn't hear anyone inside, oh, but is, I stepped outside. This is the most unique um, Shabbat evening experience I've had, but different strokes for different folks. Exactly. 
Okay. So we, you, you're graduating Carmel. Where are you going to school? I am going to Indiana University and the O'Neill School of Public and Environmental Affairs. And I'm majoring in environmental studies and sustainability. Mazel tov. Thank well, you. I'm glad that you could join us. How, how is the meet doing? Um, it's good. good. It's going slower than expected, but okay. moving along. Okay, well, take your time. Shabbat shalom, everybody. We're going to say a short prayer just to affirm the significance of this moment and to remind you all that we love you at Bethel and we want you to stay in touch with us in the year ahead. The prayer that we offer is printed in the sheet uh, that uh, Jackie held earlier. Uh, I will say on this Shabbat, we honor and congratulate our young people who will soon complete high school. May our people's love of learning inspire you in your continuing quest for knowledge. May you go from strength to strength and may the teachings of our Jewish heritage guide you in all that you do. Students, if you can join me, may we be blessed with health of body and mind so that we may be able to fulfill our hopes and aspirations as we advance in our studies. May we grow in wisdom as we increase our knowledge. May we gain in understanding. Let's ask students and parents and family to say together the Sheikh Hayyan. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Sheheyanu Vekiimanu Vehigiyanu Lazman Hazeh. Amen. Mazel tov to everybody. Cantor Melissa is going to uh, bring this moment together with a beautiful prayer known as the Kaddish de Rabbanan, the prayer for our teachers. This version from uh, Debbie Friedman, dedicated to our teachers, to our students, and to Lagba Omer. For our teachers and their students, and the students of the students, we ask for peace and loving kindness, and let us say Amen. And for those who study Torah here and everywhere, be blessed with all they need and let us say Amen. We ask for peace and loving kindness and let us say Amen. We ask for peace and loving kindness and let us say Amen. continue with our evening's service as we have been mentioning we're celebrating today Lagba Omer which is the 33rd day of the Omer and so as we release it and enter Shabbat we will take a moment to count for the next day of the Omer you can find the blessings and the listing for the day uh, in our song sheet I'll the cantor start with our blessing Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam Asher Kiddushanu b'mitzvotav Betzivanu Al sefirat ha'omer Ayom Arba'a u'shloshim yom Sheheim arba'a Shavuot v'shisha yamim la'omer. Blessed are you, Adonai, our God, ruler of the universe, who sanctifies us with mitzvot and commands us concerning the counting of the Omer. Today marks 34 days, which make four weeks and six days of our counting of the Omer. This time, we continue our service uh, with the Mourner's Kaddish. So we recite the Mourner's Kaddish. We affirm our awareness of holiness in our world. We know that much of our own experiences of divine goodness, grace, and love has come from those whose lives have touched our own. This week, we extend sincere condolences to Robert Glasser, Nancy Weiss, and their families on the death of their beloved mother and grandmother, Anne Glasser. Also to the families of Eugene Starr, Harriet Morrison, 
and Sanford Circus. We also honor the memories of those who've died as a result of the pandemic we face as a nation and a worldwide community. This week, we also share in the sadness felt by many Jews all over the world following the tragedy that unfolded in Israel last night. So as we transition from Lagba Omer and into Shabbat, we hope that peace of Shabbat will usher consolation and comfort to the victims, to their families. For all of those who are in mourning, who are remembering a loved one, observing yard site, or who are moved to do so, please rise and join me in the Mourner's Kaddish on page 131. Yitkadal ve'yitkadash shemei rabah. Amen. Ve'alma divrach yirutei, ve'amlich malchutei, Bechayechon of Yomechon of Chayet, a whole Beit Israel, Baagala of Isman Kari, the Imru Amen. Yehe Shme Rabah Mevarach, the Alam Ume Amaya. It Barach, the Ishtabach, the It Paar, the It Ramam, the It Nase. It Adar, the It Ale, the It Alal. Shme de Kudesha, Berehu. Leela, Minko Birchata, the Shirata. Tush Behata, the Nechamata. Da Amiram ve Alma, ve Imru, Amen. Yehe Shlama Rabba Min Shemaya, ve Chayim Alenu ve Alkol Yisrael, ve Imru, Amen. Ose Shalom bim Romav, hu ya ase Shalom, Alenu ve Alkol Yisrael, ve Alkol Yoshbe Tevel, ve Imru, Amen. Thank you. Thank you all for joining us for this very special service. Uh, a little bit longer than our usual Kabbalat Shabbat experience, but I think it was worth it to uh, celebrate face-to-face uh, -face with our graduates, to uh, honor uh, and uh, rejoice with our teachers and students, and to welcome a beautiful new baby into our uh, Bethel Tzedek community as we celebrate with the Doc family. Um, I would like to remind you that tomorrow morning there is Torah talk at uh, 9 a.m., which is earlier than usual, because at 9.30 there is um, a Tat Shabbat with Rabbi Jenny, and then the regular live stream service will be at 10 o'clock. So for all these events, um, turn to our uh, website and you will find their access like to remind you all that next week, next Friday evening is a very special moment in our calendar as we honor uh, the uh, 40 years of service and express our love to Joni Waldman, uh, who is with us tonight as well. So join us with Joni and with her family to uh, express uh, our tribute and our gratitude. We're gonna conclude the service with the singing of a uh, song that wishes Everyone, a journey of health, of joys, and of peace. Tefilat Haderich, the prayer for the journey in honors of our teachers, our graduates, and for all of us on life's journey. Uh, you will find the words in the website. Mazel tov to the docs and malakis and to all the teachers and students and to all who have celebrated with us tonight. Shabbat shalom. Stay on and greet one another, say hi, and uh, we move on. Mazel tov, everybody. Yeah, mazel tov. Shabbat shalom, mazel tov. Shabbat shalom everybody. Mazel tov. Shabbat shalom. Don't eat next week with you. Mazel tov. 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 M
90 screens. Yeah. At least yeah. four people. I probably have salon for my or something. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What is that baby doing? Yeah, reverse slide there. <laughs> Turn, it around. Turn it around. You know what? That, Turn the slide the around. That originally went to off. Work was there. The nine yeah. of them. Yeah, sure. Um, oh. Hard to read backwards. There we go. Mazel tov. It's a good thing we know how to read Hebrew because we can read from right. Do <laughs> <laughs> you want to say Mazel tov? Queenie, you want to say Mazel tov? Mazel tov. Where is Evelyn? Can she say Mazel tov? Queenie, come here. You want to say Mazel tov? Come here. Okay. <laughs> oh, the whole family is there. Look at that. E Evelyn, say Mazel Tov. <laughs> so sweet. Quinny, come here, babe. Can you come here? No. Okay. Synagogue stars. Shabbat, Shabbat stars. <laughs> Mazel Tov graduates. Stay in touch. See you soon. Alton, I recently spoke to about 250 Wabash students oh, in class. Perhaps they'll invite me again next year when you're there. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Thank you for joining us tonight. Have a great Shabbat night. Shalom. Thank you. Shabbat Catch shalom. the replay on our YouTube channel. Thank you. Bye. Bye.